Hello everyone, a uh, bit of a different sort of uh, Wally -E video for today, but uh, I want to want to talk a little bit about some problems I really kind of have with the game. Uh, also, I've noticed over here I've fallen down to 54th on the leaderboard. Oh wow, I'll have to have to start grinding this game again. But uh, anyways. Uh, Real quick disclaimer, I'm recording the audio separately on my computer and recorded the gameplay on my Xbox, so if there's a slight delay in either of those, uh, I'm sorry, I'll try my best in editing to get rid of that, but I really just want to talk about the... Let's just cut to the chase. Look at these prices are... They, they need reworked. Now... 90,000 wins. It it already sounds like a lot, but then once you've... If you do some math, then... It, it gets really bad. So, let's just say you want this Blossom Trail. It's the most expensive item in the game. 90,000 wins. Uh, Just check my notes here. It, it, it's really... This is way too expensive. I mean, just looking at my notes. Uh, scroll up here. If you have the same pet as me, uh, it gives you 10 wins every time you actually... If you gives you 10 currency wins, I'll call them, every time you get a, a game win. So every time you beat the game, you'll get a cur 10 currency wins. This is only a 10% chance. And... You'll have to beat the game 9,000 times in order to afford this. Now, obviously, every time you beat the game, you're going to be getting keys and go most likely eventually get the 1% chance. Hopefully, way before you've gotten to 9,000 game wins, I would hope. But then the math for that is also uh, really expensive. That's still 1,800 times of doing the same thing over and over again. Uh, you, there is, uh, there is a game pass to let you equip an extra pet. How much is it? Oh, well, it's 50 Robux. It's actually a lot cheaper than I thought it would be, but still, I, I would, I think we should be able to equip two for free and then make a game pass and let us equip three of them. And these prices, like, even then, assuming you have two of the same pet I do, Gives me 10 wins, so I'd get 20 wins every time I beat the game. That's still having to beat the game 4,500 times. And assuming you had two of the best pet, which is either a 1% chance, or you could just straight up buy one for the... 1,599 Robux, that is... that That's, that's outrageous. It should not... I think it should be lowered to... Like 400, and that's still, I think, pushing it for a game like this where there's not too much for you to do. Uh, but it, it's it gets worse when you do the math. So let's assume, like, all right, so a six-minute run of this game is super easy if you know what you're doing. So let's assume you. So let's assume you just do the grind out the game, right? Let's say you have the best pet. You have 50, you're getting 50 wins every time, right? So that's 1,800 times. Uh, you have to beat the game six minutes each time. Uh, I did the math. That is 648,000 seconds. And according to Google, that is literally 180 hours. So you have to basically play this game like a full-time job in order to get one trail. I And I could tell they wanted this to be like a really hard to get trail, but at a certain point you have to think to yourself, is this a game or is it a, just a job? Like literally no one is going to get this. Like it's just kind of, I, I definitely think it should be lowered to like 10,000. Because I did the math, and if you have the pet, same pet as me, you'll have to beat the game a thousand times, but once you get the 1% chance pet, if you have the 50 wins pet, 
Uh, that's still 200 game wins. Uh, still a lot, but definitely a lot better than 1,800, I would say. Uh, definitely much, much more manageable to a lot of people. Uh, it's just kind of... The, the pricing needs to be adjusted on, like, a lot of these things. I definitely think 90,000 times. Like, that's that's a full-time job. 180 hours to get one item in a game. That's kind of ridiculous. Uh, let's say, let's say you have the pet for the first 1,000 wins. Let's say we lowered the price of this Blossom Trail to... Uh, 10,000 wins. Uh, assuming for the first 1,000 wins, you had the pet that I do. Gives you 10 wins each time, so... That'd be 100 wins, and you'd have 1,000... 1,000 currency wins, and then... From there, if you end up getting the 1% chance, it is 180 times you have to beat the game. It's still... That, that's still a lot, but I mean, like, I can tell they really want this to be, like, a really hard-to-get trail. It's not supposed to be something, like, the average person is just gonna be running around with, but... I mean, just look- this game is, like- this game, like, had a lot of people recently. I mean, if my videos say anything, I usually only get, like- 20, maybe 30 views on a good video, and my Wally speedruns were getting like 600. That shows to me personally that this game has a pretty big audience if my small channel is able to reach that many people. I mean, look at the leaderboard. Not even the person with the most wins in the games. This Zef the Zephyr guy, I, I apologize if I'm butchering your name. They have 12,000 currency wins. This does not count how many times you've beat the game. This counts how many total wins you've uh, obtained the currency version. So, if he, assuming he saved up all of those wins, he would he would only be able to get this this trail here. He would still really have to be grinding for this one. Uh, the rest of these, all of these, all of these. I mean, like. Not even the top player on the wins leaderboard is able to even be, get close. He's not even able to get close to being able to afford the best trail in the game. The top player. That definitely seems like it needs to be adjusted, I would say, to 10,000. I mean, like, yeah, so far only this top player would be able to afford it, but... I would say that's still definitely much better than needing to play the game for 180 hours. And that's that's assuming you're playing the game for 180 hours straight. That's not assuming that you take a break to go eat, or to just go relax and do something else, or to even sleep. You- that's- that's not even accounting for any of that. Uh... It- it definitely needs a rework. Uh, I feel like I'm kind of repeating myself here, so I'm probably gonna get close to wrapping this whole thing up, but... Yeah, I, I, I think these chances are okay. This is outrageous, the fact that it co this pet right here costs 1,599 Robux. That is... That is over $10 for a... for... this. And then it's still going is going to require you to play this game like a full time job. That's definitely needs re reworked. Uh, I and yes, I I probably should have said this earlier in the video, but I know the description of the game says that they are they are uh, going to readjust things. Uh, they they acknowledge that this game is still new. Uh, that's, but that's really just why I'm making this video. Maybe the devs can see this video. Maybe this can help them, uh, hopefully decide to lower the cost of these trails. Because, I mean, like, this one trail costs basically 180 hours of your time. 
and that's only one trail, and then you, if you want one of these, you'd have to do the same thing, just slightly less time. Slightly less time. I can tell they want these to be, like, really difficult to get, but I mean, not even the... Not even the... Not even the top dog on the leaderboards is able to even come close to affording these. He doesn't even have half or even a quarter of the amount of money you need. Second place is well behind. There's literally no way that they're anywhere close to being able to get enough wins. Yeah, definitely. Uh, definitely share this video around, and if you want to, comment what your opinion is. Uh, obviously, the more people we have here, the better results we'll probably be able to get, uh, assuming the devs even actually see this. <laughs> that's yet another reason for you to share this video around, but yeah, I think that's probably where I'm gonna end things off. Uh, yeah, I'll see you all next time, I suppose. I'll probably... 54th place? Wow, I really fell off. Wow, okay. I'm gonna have to really be grinding this game. I'll probably do that after this video goes live, but yeah, that's really all I have uh, I'll see you all next time, I guess. Goodbye.